Hello dear students, Assalamu alaikum to all. Hope that you all are good and doing great at your homes. Once again, I am your class teacher with the subject of numeracy skills. And today, our topic is small, smaller, smallest. This is the second chapter of your numeracy skills. Today, I am going to help you to understand the concept of small, smaller, smallest. In the previous chapter, I have taught you the concept of big, bigger and biggest. Now once again, our concept is based on the size. Do you know when we compare more than two objects on the basis of their size, we use term big, bigger, biggest and small, small, smallest. When we arrange the things from left to right in order of their decreasing size, we use the term for the first most object as small, second object as smaller and third object as smallest. Because the size in objects ka wo gharta ja raha hai gharta ja raha hai move from left to right size jo hai wo gharta ja raha hai pehle object ka size bada hota hai in sab se usse uske baad jo object aata hai wo uska size pehle wale se kam hota hai aur jo last par object yani right side pe jo object aata hai uska size in do se कम होता है यानी द ऑब्जेक्ट व्हिच इज एट द राइट मोस्ट साइज हैज स्मॉलर साइज नाउ द फर्स्ट ऑब्जेक्ट इज कैप्शनड विद द टर्म स्मॉल सेकंड ऑब्जेक्ट इज कैप्शनड विद द टर्म स्मॉलर एंड the third one is captioned with the smallest. We use smaller for the middle object because smaller means it is lesser in size than this first one. It is when we use er as suffix to the small. That means this object is lesser in size than the first. But greater in size than the third and when we use the term smallest smallest that means the object which is captioned with the term smallest is much less lesser in size than the other two objects this one is much lesser in size than other two objects so, when we arrange the objects in order of their decreasing size, we use the term for the first one small, the second one smaller and the third one smallest. So, now you can see here three butterflies. Can you say, can you say which is small, which is smaller and which is smallest? Just compare their size. This is small, this is smaller and this is smallest. You have to write down the word small, smaller, smallest. Now here, you have to do, to do an activity. You have to do an activity. You have to color the drum which is smallest among all green and the color the drum which is Largest in size among all, you have to color that yellow. So, can you compare these three drums? This is largest one because its size is much greater than the other two drums. You have to color it with yellow color. You have to color it with yellow color. You can use sketch pens or crayons. So, which one is smallest among all? 
this drum is smallest among all you have to color it with the green color so this was your today's topic i hope you might have enjoyed it and understood the concept i will meet you again till then allah hafiz and take care